Hi, I'm Richard, the Additional Learning Needs Coordinator at Scott Morgan School in St Asaph, North Wales. Um, we've really enjoyed being part of the Patron of Reading Scheme and um, the opportunity to work and develop a real lasting relationship um, for both staff, children and the community with um, a published author is a fantastic opportunity. The children have taken a lot from exploring her work, um, from the opportunity to talk with her, um, to go out into the community with her and carry out activities. In terms of impacts upon standards, indirectly, because it's all about encouraging the children to enjoy and to love reading, an indirect impact has been on um, their standardised reading scores um, that we've seen. We've seen a marked improvement in those over the course of the last three years, um, particularly some children who are really reluctant readers. Um, they've really developed their comprehension skills and their ability to retrieve and, and select information from text and apply it in a lot of curriculum situations. So it's been a very worthwhile scheme for us here. Uh, having a picture of reading is the best thing ever because it gets you into more books than you would ever read. Like, you would probably read five, but you'd pro but having a picture of reading, you'd probably read more than five. So, a patron of reading is a author who comes to your school and inspires you to read very much. It inspires you by 100%. It makes you more interested in reading books, which is what I've done for me. So, I have been reading Helena's books. I have been reading... Um, do go dog goalkeepers wear ti tiaras, and also um, what's Ukrain for football? Um, I um, Helena has a blogging site. I've been blogging on it since two thousand and eleven. Um, also, I I'm still blogging and. Uh, I've been. I was blogging for from 2011 all summer. I really enjoyed the school book quiz because it was funny to see the teachers all have to, having to read books. Because we we do a, a book quiz, the children do, and it's funny to see how the how the teachers do when they're putting pressure on the children to do it. When Helena came in. She inspired me to really want to become the school librarian. Well, my patron of reading helps me in get inspired by reading more books. And she, and she tells me to read more books like... The Boy in the Striped Pajamas that we had books and movies to. What the patron's patron of reading has done for me is that since I've had a patron of reading, I've read a lot more books because Helena is a very persuading person and can persuade you to read lots of books you usually wouldn't read at home. So I really love having a patron reading also because she's a really fun person and She's one of the, my favourite people that I've ever actually met and she's one of the two favourite people that I've ever met who are celebrities. It's good to have a patron of reading because she inspires us to read lots of different books that maybe we wouldn't choose to read and she reads these like some of them are adventurous and some of them can be completely different and it's good to read different books. Um, when we had the book quiz last year, I think it was, um, Helena wrote the script for us and she came along to uh, support us and that, uh, that made me feel really proud. Um, when we'd been to the writing squad with Helena, <coughs> um, she, when we got into the writing squad, she uh, sent through the mail uh, for me and Billy uh, these I can't remember what they were called like a journal or something a travel journal I think it was to write everything down that you saw around the world it was having a patron of reading is amazing because 
every time you have to ask someone questions about books you know you just don't always have your teachers you always have that one person which is your patriot of reading and she always brings books with us to about her and most of her books are about football and her name is Helena she has inspired me to write a load of stories I now have a massive book full of stories about football um, anything you can imagine and really she's indescribable she's amazing she's funny when she comes to visit us the book the way she reads books are amazing and that's all I have to say about Helena and the person who actually I don't really oh, mess that one up go on I'll cut it out carry on okay. and um, the only the other person is Marcelo the left back for Real Madrid who won the Champions Cup with him